hello guys and welcome back to this channel in today's video we are going to solve wasi 2021 called mathematics paper 2 question number two now this is the a part so let's solve question number 2a given that p is equal to k minus t over t plus 1 make t the subject of the relation that is for i and then i i find the value of t when p is 2 over 3 and then q is 3 over 4. so for i we are going to make t the subject of this relation and then secondly i i we are going to find the value of t when p is 2 over 3 and then q is 3 over 4. so let's start off with i we have p equals k minus t over t plus 1 this is the relation so first of all we are going to group terms containing t on one side okay now let's cross multiply so when we cross multiply we have 1 times k minus t equals p times t plus 1 we are going to multiply across 1 times q is q 1 times t is t equals p times t is pt and then p times 1 is p now we are going to transpose negative t to the right hand side so we have q minus p equals pt plus t okay now we are going to factor out t so this becomes t into bracket p plus 1 now because we want to find or make t the subject of the relation we are going to divide through by p plus 1 p plus 1 and then we have t to be equal to k minus p over p plus 1 so we've been able to make t the subject of the relation now let's solve for i i we are going to find the value of t when p is 2 over 3 and then q is 3 over 4 so we have p to be 2 over 3 we have q to be 3 over 4 we are going to find the value of t so t is equal to q minus p over p plus 1 okay now let's substitute the values of p and then q into this relation t is equal to q is 3 over 4 and then p is 2 over 3 so minus 2 over 3 divided by p is 2 over 3 plus 1 and then 1 is the same as 1 over 1 now let's find the lcm for both the numerator and the denominator so the lcm between 4 and then 3 is 12 so 12 divided by 4 is 3 3 times 3 is 9 12 divided by 3 is 4 4 times 2 is 8 divided by LCM between 3 and then 1 is 3 3 divided by 3 is 1 1 times 2 is 2 3 divided by 1 is 3 3 times 1 is 3 so we have t equals 9 minus 8 is 1 so 1 over 12 divided by 2 plus 3 is 5 5 over 3 so we have t equals 1 over 12 and then we take the reciprocal so this becomes times 3 over 5 now 3 goes into itself once into 12 4 times so 1 times 1 is 1 and then 4 times 5 is 20 so therefore the value of t is 1 over 20 now let's move on to solve the b part so for 2b given that m is 2x over 1 minus x square and n is 2x over 
1 plus x expressed in the simplest form 2m minus n in terms of x okay we are going to express 2m minus n in terms of x so we have m to be 2x over 1 minus x square and then we have n to be 2x over 1 plus x now we are going to express 2m minus n in terms of x so 2m minus n is equal to 2 times 2x over 1 minus x square minus 2x over 1 plus x okay so let's multiply across so we are going to multiply 2 by 2x so that we have 4x over 1 minus x square and then for 1 minus x square you can express that as 1 plus x and then 1 minus x so these are the factors of 1 minus x square minus 2x over 1 plus x now let's find the lcm now the lcm between 1 plus x 1 minus x and then 1 plus x is 1 plus x 1 minus x this is the lcm now 1 plus x 1 minus x goes into 1 plus x 1 minus x once so 1 times 4x we have 1 times 4x minus 1 plus x 1 minus x divided by 1 plus x is 1 minus x so that times 2x gives us 2x times 1 minus x now let's simplify so we have 1 times 4x which is 4x and then negative 2x times 1 is negative 2x negative 2x times negative x is plus 2x squared all divided by 1 plus x 1 minus x now 4x minus 2x is 2x so we can write 2x squared plus 2x over 1 plus x 1 minus x So let's factor out 2x at the numerator. So we have 2x times x plus 1 divided by 1 plus x, 1 minus x. Now addition is commutative. So x plus 1 is the same as 1 plus x. So we can cancel out the 2. And then we are left with 2x over 1 minus x. So this is our final expression. 2m minus n is equal to 2x over 1 minus x in the simplest form in terms of x.